Hey everyone, it's Mahek from Flixel. So today I wanted to talk to you guys about creating cinemagraphs from a still photo. Yeah, you heard that correctly, a cinemagraph from a still. Now think of something like a double exposure cinemagraph. The difference is with these types of cinemagraphs is that you're focusing more on the photo component while still using real video motion in the app. So to create these kinds of cinemagraphs in Cinemagraph Pro, we're going to focus on two main features and tools. The first is importing a still photo, and the second will be learning how to adjust your hardness, opacity, and brush size to create the perfect mask. So if you guys are ready, let's jump into a few examples. As always, we recommend using a camera that shoots in at least HD footage and a tripod to ensure a stable shot. You can use a product or a model for the photo you're going to shoot but also think about the kind of video that will match. How do the still and video complement one another? These cinemagraphs start with a still photo. Now, once you have a perfect shot, you can go ahead and pair it with a video of your choice. You can use something like a video that you've shot in the past. Maybe you wanna shoot something custom for this type of cinemagraph, or you can even go ahead and use stock. Regardless of your choice, make sure that the video you use follows the basic principles of cinemagraph creation. Firstly, your video must be shot on a tripod perfectly still, and it should contain a compelling motion that can be looped easily in the app. In the following examples, I'll show you how to create two different types of cinemagraphs by using two completely different photos while using the same technique and stock video. Capture your still photos. This portrait shot of Julia will work really well for a double exposure cinemagraph because we will be able to blend the photo and video together really beautifully and it will be easier to isolate a particular area in this shot of a cleaning product bottle and unveil the video beneath the photo. Next, open up Cinemagraph Pro and import your video footage. We'll be using a stock video of Ocean Waves, which will work with both shots. Let's first create a double exposure Cinemagraph. Import your still image. As you can see, the video won't be visible. Adjust your brush size, hardness, and opacity, and mask over the sunglasses. This will blend the photo and video together. Now let's use this technique with a product shot cinemagraph. So let's import the other still photo that we shot. We edited the still in an external app before importing it. Adjust the size, hardness, and opacity of your brush to create a mask over a specific area that will best tell your story. Since you are masking within a specific line, increase your hardness slightly and adjust the brush size as you mask the specific area. Let's take a look at the final two cinemagraphs. Amazing! As you can see, creating cinemagraphs from a still is incredibly easy in Cinemagraph Pro. You can create a unique kind of visual story while using the real motions of video. Imagine the possibilities. Whether you're using original creative you've shot or stock images and video, you can create some mesmerizing living photos with these techniques. If you enjoyed this tutorial and want to learn about other cinemagraph techniques or tips, let us know in the comments below or connect with us on social media. We can't wait to see what you guys create next. I'll see you later.